Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Microbiology Easy Notes. If you like this channel, please like, subscribe, comment and share. Today's topic, Acid Fast Staining. This video covers Zeal Nielsen Staining, Guignon Acid Fast Staining and Oramine Rhodamine Acid Fast Staining Method, Procedure and Principle. So let's begin. Acid fast staining is a differential staining method. It is used for those microorganisms which are not stained by simple or gram staining method. Or if they are stained by simple or gram staining method, they produce a variable reaction. Here, variable reaction means microorganisms look blue, pink or purple under microscopic observation. And which are those bacteria which can be stained by acid fast staining? Bacteria belong to Mycobacterium genus like Mycobacterium lapri, Mycobacterium tuberculosis, Mycobacterium smigmatis, Mycobacterium avium complex and Mycobacterium kensasi etc. can be stained by acid fast staining. Besides that, Nocardia genus bacteria like Nocardia brasiliensis, Nocardia cyriaci georgica, Nocardia francinica and Nocardia nova etc. can also be stained by acid fast staining. The main aim of this staining technique is to differentiate bacteria into acid fast group and non-acid fast group. Mainly there are three types of acid fast staining techniques. First is Zeal Nielsen staining technique, second is Kinion acid fast staining technique and third is Oramine Rhodamine Fluorocom staining technique which is also known as Truant method. Zeal Nielsen and Kinion methods are commonly used methods as these methods use a bright field microscope for observation which is easily available in any science laboratory while ARF method needs a fluorescent microscope for observation Therefore, it is used by large laboratories. Principle of Acid Fast Staining The cell wall of mycobacteria or acid fast bacteria contains mycolic acid, multilayer of lipids, complex carbohydrates and large amount of fatty acids. All these materials makes mycobacterial cells so complex that simple stain or gram stain cannot enter into the cell wall of mycobacteria. So these cell requires special treatment like higher concentration of dye and heat application so that stain can enter into the cell wall. First, primary stain solubilizes lipid material. Heat application further loosen up the cell wall and helps primary stain to penetrate through lipid layer and that is how stain enters into the cytoplasm. Once the stain goes into the cell, the cell will not de-stain or decolorize by acid alcohol, while non-acid fast cell gets decolorized and removes primary stain easily and becomes colorless because they lack lipid and complex material in their cell wall. This ability of the bacteria to resist decolorization with acid alcohol is known as acid fastness to the bacterium. After decolorization step, counter stain is used. Acid fast cell rejects counter stain color and retains the color of primary stain, while non acid fast cell takes up the color of counter stain. First, we will discuss about Zeal Nielsen staining. The technique was first developed by Zeal and later on modified by Nielsen, thus called Zeal Nielsen staining. Reagents used in this technique are Carbol Fusion, which is act as a primary stain. It gives pink or reddish pink color to the cell. For decolorizing, acid alcohol is used. It is solution of ethanol and hydrochloric acid in distal water. As a counter stain, methylene blue is used. It gives blue color to the cell. And now Zeal Nielsen Acid Fast Staining Procedure. First, prepare bacterial smear on clean and grease-free slide using a sterile inoculating loop. Then heat fix the slide and cool it down. Cover the smear with carbol fusion stain. Now steam heat the stain until vapor just begins to rise. Do not overheat. Allow the heated stain to remain on the slide for 5 minutes. Then Wash off the stain with clean water. After that, 
कवर द स्मीयर विथ एसिड अल्कोहल फॉर फाइव मिनट्स और अंटिल द स्मीयर इज सफिशेंटली डीकलराइज नाउ अगेन वॉश वेल विथ क्लीन वाटर एयर ड्राई द स्लाइड Cover the smear with methylene blue stain for 1 to 2 minutes. Wash off the stain with clean water or distilled water, then blot dry the slide. Observation: Examine the smear under microscope using the 1000x oil immersion objective. Acid fast bacteria appear red and non-acid fast bacteria appear blue. Next acid fast staining method is Kenyon method. Kenyon method was first developed by Joseph Z Kenyon. The Kenyon method does not require heating unlike the Zeen Linsen stain. This called cold method of acid fast staining. Heat is only used to fix the smear on slide. Now Kenyon processor reagents. Primary stain here is carbol fusion. Decolorizer is 1% sulfuric acid. and secondary stain is methylene blue kinyon method procedure prepare and heat fix the smear prior to staining then cover the smear with carbol fusion for 3 to 5 minutes at room temperature gently rinse the slide with water then run 1% sulfuric acid decolorizer over the slide for approximately 3 minutes Rinse the slide with water and decolorize again for 1 to 2 minute until the solution runs clear. Then again rinse the slide with water. Then cover the smear with the secondary or counter stain methylene blue for 1 minute. Gently rinse the slide with water then blot dry the slide. Observe the slide under microscope with 1000x immersion oil lens. Acid fast cell appears red or pink. and non acid fast cell appears blue the third acid fast staining procedure is oramine rhodamine method which is also known as truant method the method is discovered by truant and his colleagues oramine and rhodamine are non specific fluorocom dyes that are attracted to acid fast organisms Oramine and rhodamine can bind to mycolic acid present in mycobacterial cell wall and allow the stain to penetrate. Non-acid fast cells do not take up these dyes. Counter stain potassium permanganate reduces non-specific fluorescence and minimizes false positive results. Truant method reagents. Here primary stain is solution of oramine O and rhodamine B fluorescent dye. Decolorizer is 0.5% acid alcohol and counter stain is 0.5% potassium permanganate. Truant method for acid fast staining. Prepare the smear and heat fix the slide. Flood the slide with rhodamine or amine solution for 15 minutes. Do not let the surface dry. Wash the slide with the gentle stream of distilled water until no color appears in the fluent. Flood the smear with the decolorizing agent for 2 to 3 minutes and then wash with distilled water and air dry the slide. After that, flood the smear with permanganate counter stain for 2 to 4 minutes. Wash the slide gently with distilled water and then blot dry the slide. Then examine the slide with a fluorescence microscope. Acid fast bacteria appear as brightly fluorescent yellow orange cells in a dark field while non acid fast cells cannot be visualized as they did not take up fluorescent dye.